guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to talk to you about this wooden sink that I made, carved from one piece of spalted maple. Stay tuned. Using this mini chainsaw on the end of an angle grinder, I carved out this log that I got from my neighbor into a sink. The next tool I used was a Holy Galahad carbide cutter. This smooths out all those chainsaw marks and digs it down to exactly where I want it. This whole process took a really long time and it was extremely messy. It actually took me a couple of years to, to get to this place where I was satisfied with the depth and the width. So with this rough shape all fully carved out, I had to sand it so it was smooth. So I used a flat sander, a flap sander to begin with, and then I went down in grits to get it very, very smooth. Once I had the bowl down to my desired smoothness, I mixed up a two to one part epoxy, and then I spread that all over the top. And because it's wood, it's porous, so there was a lot of air bubbles which I removed in part with a torch. The heat tends to pull those air bubbles out and let the epoxy lay flat or fill in those little areas. Regardless of this, I had to put probably six coats of epoxy on this to get it really smooth the way I wanted it. So after tons of sanding and more sanding, it's finally finished and I made sure that hole was the right depth so the washer and nut on the bottom would have enough space to be secure and there was a ton of other little details that I'm not going to go into but this was a ton of work to make um, but I'm very happy with the way it turned out. It's been very rewarding and uh, I'm just going to show you some last photographs of it. Thanks for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button and hit the bell to get more notices. Thanks again.